Surfing generates a lot of interesting art and interesting people. Sean Barney Barron is definitely one of the most interesting surfers doing art and a very special person. He is a well-known pro surfer and crazy both in and out of the water. Maybe he just seems like some sort of surf wannabe weirdo if he wouldn't prove that he's a top surfer every time you see him standing on a board. He expresses his art in the water as well as on canvas. Welcome to Barney's house. Some paintings about a trip I went on, a pretty heavy trip. Pretty much just a bunch of stuff getting dusty. A friend of mine uh, made this. His name's Alex Vega. He's not only a painter, he also likes to collect a lot of art, mostly from his friends. Um, Nathan Fletcher did that one over there. The big, weird, faceless face. I did, I did that one in high school. This is the universal um, language. Sex, photography, art, math, music. Just a few steps away from his house on the west side of Santa Cruz, there is always new surf adventures waiting. Known for its sick aerial surfing, Steamer Lane is one of Barney's proving grounds. Sure, if Maverick goes off, you'll find him riding some of the monsters, but whether it's this or that, he's doing it with his own style. Um, I think when I was in my mother's belly, you know, I could see water ripples when I moved my hand. No, <laughs> no, uh, no, probably just being a kid artist, you know, and, and like, whoa, I, this would be cool and thinking of what, how to draw it. Because it doesn't matter what you create, as long as you're like in that mode of creating, could be nothing. Some, some things are never finished. No, when you really get into art, and it's like a, it's like driving by yourself, you know, for a long distance. You don't want to do it, but once you're doing it, you know, you start thinking about everything. I think I, I've never liked to be bored, you know. Sometimes I have layers of thought, you know, and it's hard to um, read because I'm thinking about something else and wanting to do something else. And now an example of how this process of creation can look in the future. I would love to harness the power of thinking in the past, why I'm in the present, knowing what I'm going to do in the future. It's like you're, going, you're, you're cleaning out your mind, you're vacuuming out your mind, and, and then someone's looking in the vacuum to see what was vacuumed. Surfing's art, yeah. It's when you're doing a maneuver, similar to skiing and skateboarding, but you could really see the um, definition of your of the your track, you know, off your tail. So you're doing a bottom turn, you see all the spray come up off the lip, you see all that spray. It's nice to always try to be creative a little bit in your surfing, you know. Sometimes you want to do standard maneuvers, but other times you want to try to, you know, do something you haven't done before. I've always liked that, you know, so um, try to do that in the paintings too. 